Uh, you guys requested it and I'm going to show you guys how to use the uh, cooling system refiller part number or SVTSRAD272A. We're going to use this 3.5 liter Chrysler engine uh, with the stupid composite tank. So uh, let's get into it. Everybody hates you when you love rock and roll! The kit, it's basically just the kit with two hoses. Um, okay, so I'm gonna put this onto the tripod and I'll show you guys how to hook it up. This one we don't need an adapter for because we have the proper, uh, uh, the proper rad. It's basically just a domestic spout. So let's see here. All right. You have two hoses. This is for uh, just for bleed off. This is where the air is going to come in and, and uh, create your vacuum. And then this one goes into your your fresh coolant tank. So we got some fresh coolant. I drained the radiator. Um, the radiator had clean coolant in it anyway. I just didn't bleed it properly because these systems are a little bit tricky. So uh, it's just basically Dex Cool, whatever. It's just long life antifreeze. This one goes into here. So that'll be our fill tube and this is just our bleed off basically just take your bleed tube and uh, an empty jug so we're gonna hook up the shop air and I will show you guys how to do this we want both valves closed this valve this valve we're gonna hook it up we're gonna open this valve and that's gonna start start the vacuum it's also going to collapse our upper and lower rad hoses, all our uh, heater hoses. I'm going to vacuum it down to 25. I'm going to shut that off. Then we're going to open this. And there we go. We are filling. Make sure you do not run the coolant bottle dry because otherwise you're just putting air into the system. At this point, we are down to pretty much nothing for vacuum and it is full. So close it off, unplug it. We should just be able to uh, take this thing off and we are full. There you go guys, simple as that. If you guys get a chance to get one of these off the truck, get one, it's definitely worth the money. Now we're not gonna have any kind of vapor lock inside this system, 100% full. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed the video on how to use the cooling system filler. Uh, remember to comment, like, share, subscribe, and all that fun stuff, and peace out. We will see you guys in the next video, thank you.